I mean, another great athlete. I mean, you talk about it, you know, we did discuss this about, you know, um, Jared verse. I mean, another great athlete also sticking with the seminal here. So I was right in a sense that I had them trading up for a seminal. I just didn't have them trading up for the correct seminal. Cause he was gone at pick 33, uh, one year starter, you know, so this is somebody that lined up, um, you know, on that front. And, you know, I think really what you're getting with verse or excuse me, Fisk is you're getting somebody who has an elite get off. I mean, he ran a 1.68 10 yard split. He's explosive. He's 6'3, 293. Um, this is somebody who had 26 on the bench press. So that's something that Jared Verse is probably going to clown him at because he had 31. Um, but they're both wicked strong. They're both explosive. The reason why he doesn't go in the first round is because of the arm length. There's a lot of teams that were really, you know, scared by the arm length. But I think this is somebody that can come in right away, give you a guy, um, you know, that can, you know, rush up. Uh, you know, rush up the interior. Um, you can even put him out, out on the outside like they did with Donald. Um, so now the up front, I mean, I do not, if I'm the Rams or if I'm going up against the Rams, I don't want to be on third and long. That is what the Rams have just said. We are going to make your, your life a living hell. If you're passing on third and nine or, you know, third and 15, a, a big thing because last year, big reason why they lost that game to the Ravens, they could not stop him on third and long. So now you have this. Uh, it seems, yeah, I, I get that, Tyler. It does seem a little steep, I guess. But I like the move because, look, next year, they're going to be a wicked good team. They it means that basically they're going to hold on to their first-round pick for next year, and they go out and they get two guys that can contribute right away. This is going to be a starter. He's going to be next to Bobby Brown. He's going to be next to Kobe Turner. The Rams up front with those guys, with you know, going out and getting verse, going out and getting Byron Young last year. And then keep in mind they spent two picks on guys that could also pan out in Nick Hampton and of course O'Shawn Mathis and you have Michael Hoyt. The Rams just turned something that was considered a weakness for a lot of people into an ass kicking defensive front. And I'm very excited about it. 